What is good everyone? Today I have this huge mystery box from the Instagram reseller Direct Souls. I think I've done three boxes on him so far and they've all been pretty good. I've sold all those shoes pretty fast, made some good profits, so he offered me this bigger one. The other three I bought off him were all at 1000 but again, this is $2,100 after the shipping costs and everything. So yeah, hopefully this is another good box with some good profit, some good shoes. It's an extra large box, by the way, so I'm not expecting a ton of heat. There might be like a lot of smaller items since it's a big box. But yeah, that's enough talking for now. Let's get into this. All right, just got it cut open. Let's see how it looks now. I see more clothing items. You put a few of the, those inside the other boxes. I don't usually get that often, but certain ones still good for me. So here's how the box is looking. Let's go with this shoe, because this isn't... Well, actually, it's just start with all the clothing. I see two right there. That might be it. So let's get into it. This is going to be a knowledge tee. <clears throat> it's a Supreme Knowledge Team at size XL. This is going to be a neck pouch Supreme. I actually got this from a different box. I don't know if that was his, but I did get it the other day and it sold right away. So that should be a fast sell. And then let's look up this. So for the Supreme neck pouch, here's how it looks, by the way, outside the bag. It goes for 55. So 55 for that. And for the Supreme Knowledge Tee, a size XL, lowest S is at 90. There's no highest bid, which means no one's trying to buy it at the moment. More of the recent sales is around 60 and 50. There's actually only been four recent sales, all of them in 2022. Um, I was just marking it right in between that, so at 55, which puts my total to 110 so far after the neck pouch and the t-shirt. Now let's get into the shoes. I already know what this is. <clears throat> this isn't a great shoe, but a size eight. Give me the Jordan 13 Obsidians. Has a receipt, I think I saw. Yeah, so from finish line. So here's the shoe. They are brand new. Pretty sure they're going for under retail. And a size 8 for the Jordan 13. So I'm going to mark it at 190. So 190 for that. 300 so far. A lot of shoes to go. So let's go with this Desert Boot. This is another shoe that doesn't really move too well for me. It's a small size 2. A size 4.5. It says it's going to be the oil colorway. I don't really know how that's, how that's going to look. But here it is. Brand new, so tag is still on. I don't know. I feel like these might be a little harder to move. Who knows? Maybe they will sell fast. I've been surprised in the past with how fast some shoes sell. So who knows? This is my first time ever getting this. So I don't really know what to expect. But yeah, this is going to be the second shoe overall, though. In a size four and a half for those. Going for, I mean, there's a huge difference. Last sell was 217, which is actually pretty good. Other recent sells is under 200. A lot of them around the 180 range. So that's what I'm going to mark it at. That might even be a kind of harder price to get. But like I said, I might be surprised. But let's move on. Two items so far. Two shoes. See a couple SB boxes. I'll probably save that for last. Here's a Jordan box. Jordan 1 low in a size 10. Yeah, I've never seen this colorway before. Don't really... I mean, the colorway itself is pretty nice. I'm not sure if I'm a big fan of the material on it. But here they are. I'm not expecting these to go for anything too much. But who knows? It might. Here's the colorway and details all around on it. So those like are I called said. the Jordan 1 low Paris in a size 10. Look how much they're going for. Highest bid's already a lot more than I expected. Last sells at 450. Other recent sells. I mean, all of them are over 400. So they've actually been selling for a good amount. I'm going to mark it at, I don't know, I think exactly 400 is fair. So with 400, that already puts me at 880. After those Paris Jordan 1 lows. So that's insane that a pair of lows go for that much. The only other lows that I could think of that goes for a lot is the Zion's. Yeah, that's a good shoe. Here's the next shoe, a Terminator High, size 11 and a half. So never even heard of those before, never seen them. Don't know what to expect, but here we go. And here they are. Oh, this kind of reminds me of a combination of like Blazer Highs, Dunk High. 
So, like I said, I know nothing about this shoe. There's a T on the back, I'm assuming for Terminator. But this is going to be the next one. Let's see if market's going to be super high on them. So here's what it's called, by the way. It's a has a really long name. Size 11 and a half. There's a huge difference. Last sell was only 75. Other sells around 100. Um, for this shoe, I don't think I could get too much for them. I'm going to mark it at like 90. Right in between the last sell and 100. So 90 for that. 970. So not quite halfway. The price that I paid so far. Here's more items, by the way. Looks like another shirt. This is a Experientia tee. It's unopened, by the way. It's a Supreme shirt, size XL again. Here it is. So I'll look this one up, see what it's going for. So here's how it looks. Just that little circle design right there. Asks at 68, last sale was 54. Other recent sales is actually a lot lower. All of them in 2022. Um, I'm marking at like, I guess 50 is fair. So 50 for that, that's gonna put me over a thousand. After the shirt with still a good amount of shoes left. <clears throat> Here's this one, a woman's Jordan one mid. 10 and a half women, so that's gonna be a nine in men's. And it's gonna be these. No, I don't think I've ever gotten these before. They are brand new. You can see the details on it though. That's a blue Jordan on the midsole, which doesn't really match the shoe, but that's how it looks. Other shoes the same. So yeah, that's the next shoe though. So right now those mids, there's another weird market. That's how it's looking. So let's go into the last sales again. Some recent sales around the 180 range. A lot of them, or most of them, is under 200 besides the last one. So, I, like a lot are, are around 150. So, I guess that's what I'm going to mark it at. Hopefully, he didn't price those too high. But, yeah, that's a scary one right there. Let's move on, though. Looks like, I think, four shoes to go. I'm just going to go with this SB. It's a dunk high, and it's a size 14. So, a big size right here. Oh, I just got these the other day, too. The one I got the other day was a size 10, I think. And those actually sold a day later. But this one, a big size. I don't know how easy these are going to be to sell. I think they're going for around 300, though. It's cool colorway, cool design. But uh, just one of the more tougher sizes. And a size 14 for those, going for 320. So 320 for that. 1490 still... 610 away from what i paid six shoes in two shirts a neck pouch let's go with this shoe he had cool box paper from what i saw that fell out so i have to get that before i forget so this is i'm assuming goes with this this is a size 14 jordan one low by the way so another big size but here's the shoe, the Chinese New Year Jordan 1 Lows. These are actually pretty sick. Comes with this. In case you guys don't know, people give each other money on Chinese New Year. I'm a, Like I said, I think that comes with the shoe. So here it is though, the third to last shoe overall. This is my first time getting these in hand. Colorways, pretty nice. Cool box paper, like I said earlier. You see the details on it though. Cool looking insole, but yeah, this is the next shoe though. Hopefully it goes for a really good amount. And a size 14 for those, they're at 190, so not going for as much as I thought. But that puts me at 1680. So only 1680, I paid 2100, so, and two more shoes to go. So I'm really hoping he didn't price those too high, those too high. I think I marked those pretty good. And then I don't know, but. Let's see, SB and then a Jordan 4 box, I think. So let's just go with the SB. This is going to be an SB Dunk Low, size 10. So my size, let's see if it's a good shoe. And it's not. <laughs> it's just these Polaroids. They're brand new. 
pretty sure these are going for about 150, 160. And then size 10, just gonna round it up to 160. So with 160, I'm only at 1840. So um, that's like what, 260 away from what I paid? With one shoe. Can't really think of much Jordan 4s that go for like 500, 600 to where the box would be 20% ROI. Let's open it first before I keep judging. It's a woman's Jordan 4, size 10 and a half women's, nine in men's. And it's just the frozen moment Jordan 4s. So yeah, guys, this is gonna be the last shoe overall. Pretty sure these are going for about 250, 260-ish. Good colorway, cool looking shoe, but yeah. That's the last one. Yeah, ten and a half women's for those going for two eighty. So actually a little more than I thought. So with two eighty, everything only adds up to twenty one twenty. I paid twenty one hundred, so yeah, I'm gonna have to DM him see where we could have possibly went wrong. I marked all the shoes pretty fair, except maybe those. But I mean, recent sales weren't looking that good, and it may be the boots, but not, you know. 300 400 dollar difference so i'm gonna dm him see what happened and i'll keep you guys updated i now do raffles on my instagram daily so if you're into that kind of stuff and want to join a future one shoot my instagram a follow it's jc resells 559 same exact name as my youtube name Thank you guys for the support and I hope to see you in the future raffle.